Here is a tool for finding emails on LinkedIn. Now our previous search got us to uh, some LinkedIn profiles. Uh, the name of this tool, which is a Google extension, is called Profit. Um, now Profit, the way to get to Google extensions, usually you just go Google Store and go there, but this one is, um, you have to kind of go through a couple things to get to it, but here's a direct link to it. I'm going to leave this up here for a second. Um, if you want to copy and put it in exactly it is, it'll take you right to how to download it. Otherwise, you got to go to their site and email you and do a few things. This way, you don't have to. So we're going to control C, copy it, put it into the top of our browser. It'll take us right there. I have already added it to Chrome. It's actually right here. So I don't need to do that. Um, and we're going to, but you will need to register, sign up for it. But once you have it, it's quite useful. So we're going to go back to our search here that I've done before on LinkedIn people. So we're going to hit this person here. Okay. Now, one of my previous tools, this thing pops up a lot because I actually use a database called PC Recruiter at my work, and um, we don't need it. But over here, you'll see it was Email Hunter, which was from a previous tool that I showed you. That's there, but we're going to use this one, this little pointer right here, because I have Profit installed. If I open it, it gives me the option to find email. So I'm going to hit it. Oh, it's stumped. So it didn't like that a whole lot. So probably not the best tool to find it with, but that's okay. We used our email hunter on it, or there's other tools. You're going to find you need multiple tools. So let's go back to um, our LinkedIn list here. Let's see if we can find a different name. Here's one. And we'll use the same tool. And it actually found it already. So I don't even need to look for it. And it seems like this person's got a lot of stuff out there. You see it's got Twitter, LinkedIn, Clout. So I already have this person's email right here. But let's hit this too, see if we find any other emails. And um, so this one here was an unverified one, so probably not the one, but this one here, somewhere on this page, this email is there, so this is the correct email. So that's how you use Profit. The key to searching for people's email addresses is you want to have a lot of tools at your disposal. And if you can't find it one way, you find it another way. The key is that with these other tools, you're actually saving yourself a lot of money because this doesn't cost you anything. Now, if you do a hundred of these, they might start charging you, but you usually got a, I think you have a good amount from profit. Might be something like a hundred searches you can do. If you're using combination of a bunch of them, you're never going to run out of it because, you know, unless you're sending huge bulk emails, in which case you would want to use other tools for that kind of thing. And uh, those do cost you. But just to find individuals, this works out pretty well. So this is called Profit, another tool for your arsenal.